Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Management Consulting Journal again. And in the today's video, we're going to talk about the differences between deduction, induction, and abduction. So just a quick note, all three methods are ways to logically derive at a conclusion, but they're different as well. So we're going to talk about that today. So in deduction, you have a rule and then you see a case and you think, okay, based on that rule, I have to, I'm expecting result X. So let's look at an example. So the rule could be that if prices increase, sales will decrease. And then we see we have a case where we launch product A at a high price. Therefore, we're, the result we're going to expect is that product A sales will be low. Now, induction is the exact opposite of deduction. So in, in this case, what you're observing is a case, and then you're summarizing the result, and you're, you're, you form a rule based on what you see in the case and the result. So let's look at an example. The case could be that you increase the price on product A. And then you, you see the result is that the sales declined. And then you form a rule, which is that when sales decline, when price is too high. Now, abduction is different from deduction and induction in that it looks at the result first, and then it's, it tries to form a rule, and then it checks the case to see if it conforms to that rule. So let's look at an example of this. Uh, so the result that you see is that sales have gone down. The rule that you try to apply is that sales go down when price is too high. And then you try to check the case. You check if price is too high on product A. If yes, then this rule is true. If no, then you throw out this rule and you start the whole process again. So abduction is a method that's most commonly used in case interviews. So uh, you might see the parallel between this and the dress framework um, where you observe the the result is a problem that you observe. The rule is a hypothesis that you're trying to test. And the case is the key questions uh, that you ask the client and the information that you get back. And so I hope that this series was helpful and you now understand the differences between a deduction, induction, abduction. Uh, this concept is very important in management consulting. Thank you very much for your time. If you haven't done so already, sign up for free uh, consultation if you're interested in breaking into the management consulting industry. Questions or comments, leave it below or email me at info at management consulting journal .com. Thanks, guys. Bye.